The Beto O'Rourke road trip through New Hampshire continues. He arrived last night in Keene and spoke at the student center there. And this morning he's made stops in Claremont and Plymouth. Here in Claremont, O'Rourke drew a crowd to the Common Man restaurant. This mill town on the Connecticut River looks like it will be a battleground, not just in the Democratic primary, but also in the 2020 election. Now, Claremont voted for Barack Obama in 2008 and 2012, but then voted for Donald Trump in 2016. O'Rourke drove here from Iowa, making stops in Wisconsin, Ohio, and Pennsylvania along the way, places like Claremont, where the Make America Great Again message really resonated. But Beto says his campaign is going to be all about showing up in those kinds of places. Your prospects to, to win in an election, your ability to effectively serve once in office is premised on showing up and listening to those who understand the issues in Claremont or in New Hampshire better than anyone else. Now, O'Rourke is pledging to hit all 10 New Hampshire counties on this visit, which stretches into Thursday. So far, it's two down, eight to go. Reporting in Claremont, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.